two less than the price of the number of pants he purchased and the number of shirts is four less than the four times of number of pants he purchased. So we need to find out how many pants and how many shirts he purchased here. So let us find out that. Here it is given the number of shirts is two less than the price of number of pants. So let shirts be x shirts be x pants be y shirts we have taken as x and pants as y so in first case the number of shirts is 2 less than the price of pants shirts is equals to 2 less than 2 less 2 less than twice of the number of pants twice of pants this is the first one the number of shirts is shirts is 2 less than twice of the pants shirts is 2 less than 2 less that is nothing but minus 2 twice of the pants he purchased so first one this is second one the number of shirts is so shirts equals to the number of shirts is 4 less than that is minus 4 4 times of pants so 4 times of the pants this is the second one first one that is recall shirts is 2 less than minus 2 twice of number of pants 2 into Pants. Twice is nothing but 2, 2 into pants. Second case, shirts is 4 less than minus 4, 4 times of pants. So 4 into pants. Shirts is 4 less than 4 times of pants. So what we have considered here, shirts be x, pants be y. Shirts is x, 2 into pants is y. Here constant minus 2. Here shirts we have taken x. x is equals to 4. Pants b y. Minus 4. So let us simplify. These two equations. x minus 2y equals to minus 2. This equation x minus 4y is equals to minus 4 first one and the second one so let us simplify this after simplification we will find out the value of x and y using elimination method then we will come to know how many shirts and how many pants Ravi purchased first equation is x minus 2y is equals to minus 2 Second equation is x minus 4y is equals to minus 4. We have the two equations. We need to find out the value of x and y. In this, we can observe the coefficients of the x values in both the equations is same. So we can find out the value of x by subtracting these two equations. Let us subtract these two equations. We know the process of subtracting the two equations. There is a plus symbol here. This is a minus symbol. It's a minus symbol. When there is a minus symbol, it becomes plus. When there is a minus symbol, it becomes plus. And positive, it becomes negative. When we subtract the two equations. So, let us subtract. It becomes minus value. It becomes plus value. Minus, it becomes plus value. So, 
Then we subtract this to 1 minus 1 minus 1 is 0. Minus 2 plus 4 is nothing but plus 2. Here there is a variable y equals to plus 4 minus 2 is nothing but 2. 1 minus 1 is 0. Plus 4 minus 2 is plus 2. There is a variable y. y plus 4 minus 2 is 2. After changing the symbol here, after changing the symbol for the second equation, we consider only those symbols for the equation. So now, 2y is equal to 2, y is equal to 2 by 2, and y is equal to 1. So, the value of y we got, the process of elimination method, we will find out the value of x by substituting that value in any one of the equation. Let take the first equation 1x minus 2y is equal to minus 2. Substitute this value of y in this, in this equation y value is 1 equals to minus 2. The value of y is 1. y is 1. x is same. The value of y is 1 minus 2. So x is equal to minus 2 equals to minus 2, minus 2, if you transpose this value, it becomes plus 2, x is equal to 0. So the value of x is 0, the value of y is 1. We have taken shirts bx, shirts x is equal to 0, and pants y is equal to 1. So the number of shirts he purchased nothing and the, the number of pants he purchased is 1.